This is an extremely important area in terms of supporting families and children at an early stage in life. We can help parents provide more and extend on what they're already doing. Parents coming and seeing what actually happens in the school environment is a big plus for me. I think it's very important from very early on uh, to be involved as a parent. Children are much more confident with you because the parent has invited you into the home. Raising Early Achievement in Literacy, known as REAL, is a program aimed at improving the attainment of children in early years education in reading and writing. It's a scheme that's been rolled out in Jersey over the last two years, which aims to introduce our youngest islanders into the world of literacy. Every single early years setting on the island has had the opportunity for practitioners to come into contact with the tools and techniques that form part of the programme. We have made such an impact on early years professionals in Jersey. Such a large number of settings have been reached, really varied settings as well. Nursery schools, private and voluntary independent settings, preschools. Um, so we've really made an inroad there and now we're taking it on a step further to share that knowledge directly with parents so that they can share it with their, their local community. So and I think that's going to be a really strong uh, element of the Jersey programme, being able to kind of share it on the ground with parents as well. I'm learning how I can use my knowledge to help the parents deliver that to their children in their home setting and extend on what they already do and they are the children's best carers and they know their children better than anyone but we can help them provide more and extend on what they're already doing. It is about the children working with the families, the practitioners, because those parents know those children. They know their interests better than we do. So if we can gain an insight to that and how they're working with that at home, then it makes our job easier to plan for those needs and the next stages. The National Children's Bureau, with the support of the Jersey Child Care Trust and the Education Department, has delivered a number of training courses and practical workshops. The impact that REAL has on practitioners, parents and children is evident through various measures and feedback. You've got the support network which is very valuable when you first start because you're not quite sure how to deliver certain things, how a home visit's going to go and should I be doing this, should I be doing that. But with the support of your colleagues it runs very smoothly. Currently at um, Grooville Primary School we do a lot of involvement with parents but I think the real approach is extending on their knowledge that they already have and what they're already doing with their children and as a practitioner we can implement more tools and give them help and advice of how to extend on their knowledge already that they have. This is my first event um, in Jersey for real. Um, my little boy just started school this year, so this is the first one we've been to. I personally think it's really important because it's just making it really fun for them and bringing it back into the home because lots of parents don't actually have a clue what goes on in the classroom because their kids don't often tell them what happens in the school days. It's exciting to sit down, we've all, all eaten, had fish and chips and see the children running around and playing with their friends and learning at the same time. Uh, it's lots of fun. The island has really embraced real and some great community events have been held involving staff from nearly all early years settings. There's no greater place than Jersey to see real come to life in all four strands of mark making and early writing, oral language, environmental print and books. Real projects really kind of uh, takes it on its own shape. And um, this is a really amazing example of, of that. So this mark making event on the beach, you know, um, using what's available and uh, each of the projects tend to do that. And the, um, the imagination of the local practitioners really comes across. Uh, and that's what's coming across here. Amazing literacy projects. So really, really nice to see. This is really positive. We've got a mixture of public and, and private areas who are come together to support children, showing their willingness and their love for supporting children as well in terms of literacy and play and care. And I think actually this is a positive move forward for the island and will encourage more people to become involved and ensure that, you know, in future that we've got a more broad spectrum of support there for all families and choices for those families. Home visits play a vital part of the real programme and in Jersey, where we have such a multicultural society, the benefits of these home visits are invaluable.
So Owen's first languages were Russian and German. English has been in the background. Kind of caught up a little bit on the letters and he could recognize the letters and he was able to read a few, a few letters together joined up and it just helped him with the language really. The homework was trying to spot um, letters around you. So that didn't take long before he then wanted to see or saw letters around him more. Even after the homework has already been handled in, he's starting to notice things more. And yeah, it just um, goes from there. The teachings of REAL in Jersey will have numerous benefits for young islanders as they embark on their journey into the wider education system. Having had such an amazing start when it comes to achieving early learning literacy skills, they will go on to have more success throughout education and beyond into their adult lives. It keeps learning real. Like for me, learning is every day, all day for my children. It's the life that they're experiencing and it's making that part of the life that's outside of their school day. We all know how important um, writing and literacy is to children, but this has just really brought it out to a head that it really is, and there's so many fun ways that you can take do things with parents and with the children. Working with all of these people from different settings is, is like a massive sharing of ideas and loads of people are already instigating all of these things in their settings so you know they're practically sharing what they're doing and I can take away a whole load of their ideas, put them in use in our setting and you know and vice versa. Sharing ideas with other practitioners I think is really valuable and seeing their passion for it is really great. Um, the confidence, I've got more confidence I feel to share this experience with parents. Primary teachers and nursery staff along with parents and children have all benefited from the rollout of Real in Jersey. It's hoped the network of knowledge formed by those who've already undergone Real training will have an amazing effect on the attainment of our island's youngsters for years to come. Having practitioners involved at an early stage and providing that quality of literacy um, will really help those children to flourish in future years.